It's been said that no one in this world can love a girl more than her father. A windward Oahu man was able to show his eldest daughter that love to the very end. Ron Mizutani shares their story in tonight's Elderhood Project. Colin Kimo Gonzalez's body was shutting down, but there was a grand event that he could not miss. My wedding was actually scheduled for July 23rd, so that was his goal, was to walk me down the aisle. The family was dealt a blow when doctors told them that chemo may not make it. So we decided that we we're going to go through and have this wedding done here, whether it was at Dad's room or here in the um, chapel. A wedding was going to happen the following day at Castle Medical Center. Chemo would not be denied his final wish. And they were wheeling him in, in the door, the nurses, and he stopped the procession and he said, no, I'm walking my daughter. And he stood up and he walked me to the front and he asked Chaplain Dave, or he actually asked me, doesn't he have to ask me something? <laughs> and we laughed and Chaplain Dave asked him, who gives this woman to this man? And my dad said, I do. It was a special moment between father and daughter. And it was almost like he had so much energy that he you know, was able to walk me down the aisle, but he also was able to tell me how much he loved me, how much he cared. But Kimo found strength, then turned to his wife of 33 years, and the couple renewed their vows. It was God's plan because he wasn't able to do Saturday. Kimo died four days later. He got to do what he set out to do, you know, his maybe final responsibility, you know, and he got to walk his oldest daughter down the aisle. A father holds his daughter's hand for a short while, but he holds her heart forever. Kimo is still holding Jamesy's. For the Elderhood Project, I'm Ron Mizutani.